Europe has had a difficult time over the past six years. The European Investment Bank's Economics Conference this year had as a theme investment and investment finance in Europe, putting Europe on a sustainable growth path. And while there are signs of a recovery, it is not the occasion to celebrate or get complacent. There are ways to improve the situation, however. What is needed is investment in sectors that can compete successfully in the global markets, the so-called tradable sectors, investment in education, investment in new technology that are powerful sources of growth. And to support investment, first of all, we need a repaired and efficient financial and banking system in Europe, which is still not yet available. But I think that much progress has been made, and so this uh, bodes well for future investment in the, in the region. The message now is the need to pull together, the need for unity, and while the system can be simplified, the process is complex, but all must be ready to play their part. The EIB is clearly no exception. Investment is needed, I would say, in all countries of the Eurozone, certainly in program countries in the south, but also in core countries where the situation is much better, because investment has been going down in all of these areas. EIB support, I think that this could be extremely important uh, when we consider the investment needs of small and medium enterprises and their difficulty in accessing credit, especially at times like these. So EIB uh, support of, say, collateral to uh, facilitate credit flowing to SMEs would be an important element of a new uh, upsurge of investment. Where each nation may have its own issues to address, there exists a series of challenges implicating the whole continent. But just as we should not celebrate, neither should Europe be too pessimistic. Challenges are clear. First of all, debt consolidation uh, must be completed and here we are a long way there because this would lower country risk and help uh, eliminate fragmentation. But after that we need to speed up the construction of a full-fledged banking union with a single supervisory authority and a single financial backstop to support the case uh, in, uh, in the case we need to resolve banks in difficulty. And on, in this process we, we need also banks to strengthen their capital so that their lending will be easier and more accessible in the future.